We got the oh. game. Oh, I think I know this one. Think about it, chat. But we got some, we got some, uh, an immediate big punish over, oh, was that a stock? Zero to death right away from Sleek One. Oh my God, that was incredible. Showing the Sleek One that he is not afraid of him. And he so could- the answer for those curious was hidden power. Hidden power, oh, I was gonna guess super power, but. That uh, might also be correct, but I don't think I don't think Reggie Ice can learn superpower. Yeah, I could learn superpower. All three of the original Reggies could learn superpower. And Reggie Gigas. Uh oh man, I'd have to check. But uh, in addition to that, um, all Reggies except for the new ones cannot learn Toxic. That is true. So uh, the sleek one just giving. Getting the hand, sorry, from Shadowhawk yeah, here. Getting absolutely mollywopped. I don't know what's going on. Just as soon as you put Sleek on stream today, he is losing. Uh-huh. Yeah, maybe he's just tired. Maybe he's got stage fright. Yeah. Like, uh, like when, like when you go to the, like, when you're in the bathroom, and you're in the urinal, and then there's the dude that comes and goes right to the urinal next to you, and you can't get it going? Yeah, that's stage fright. Oh, yeah. It's happened to me, it's happened to you. It happened to everybody who uses the urinal. And right now, it is happening to the sleek one. On the urinals of battle. The urinals of battle. Mole, I fucking love you. I love you too, Wombat. Oh, that, that oh. was a bold, that was a bold Dacus right there. He expected him to, I guess, like short hop uh, side B in. Mm-hmm. Oh yeah, yeah, definitely. A nice shield by the Sleek One. I feel that such boldness uh, is acceptable given the lead that Shadow Hawk has over the Sleek One. At the same time, Sleek One's a very good player. He's had some very good wins in this bracket alone. So he is not one to be slept on. Also, this is a pretty this is a pretty good placing for Ed anyone who gets this far. This is the second this is the second biggest Wombat Wednesday ever. Uh, can you remind me how many entrants does the big wombat one, the biggest wombat Wednesday, also known as Wombat Wednesday twenty four, have? Forty seven. Forty seven. And then this one has, I believe, forty four. Oh, is that so? I thought we got fifty something last week. No, we got forty nine people signed up, and then two didn't check in. Ah, uh, gotcha. Yes, yeah, still very impressive turnouts, which means. Ooh, nice deck is. Yeah. Not Fire enough because Rob is be... Rob eats cake for breakfast, but it was very nice. Yes. And you could see that because Rob uh, has eaten cake for breakfast, it's it's really uh, jamming his mainframes here. Because robots can't eat cake. Says you. Says me. Yes. What if there was a robot who was specifically designed for eating cake, and what if that robot was the sleek one? Well, Perhaps um, we'll find out, but if we do, but it's Shadow not going Hawk to be during this game. He'll be having his cake and eating it, too. Yup. You know, I never understood that phrase, because if you have your cake and eat it, too, don't you... Of course you're going to eat it if you have it. What it, it should be, you can't eat your cake and have it, too. Because but you, you can. Cake, no, if you eat the cake, you don't have the cake anymore. Okay. That's what it means. Gotcha. So, so he's doing something that he can't. But back to the match. The sleek one goes to his chimed, tried and true, padded fox. So I said that earlier that this Lucas fox is has super given me, good. This fox has given me a lot of anguish over the years. Oh yes, Fox Squirtle is not a great matchup for Squirtle. I say it is, it is not. But also, the nice fox thing about Fox is that he gets countered by Fox. Sleek one might be the only fox who actually knows the Squirtle matchup. Which oh, yeah, like guys play every week. Yeah, we used to play every single week. You also used to play them every single week. I did. Uh, there was a weapons triangle between me, you, and the Sleek One. It's a little bit different right now, but it would go, I beat the Sleek One, you beat me, and then the Sleek One defeats you. Yeah. It was a fun little uh, thing that would happen that would made, uh, that made HBA tournaments a little less predictable, especially when Zubat wouldn't show up. 
Yeah. And then there was Zubat. He'd give us all the hands. But uh, back to the match. I think this was a very nice counter pick. I said before that Lucas is good at comboing uh, characters who fall pretty fast. But I would imagine that Fox falls a little bit too fast for Lucas to get that maximal damage output that he does on other characters, such as Lucas and Lucario. He has other combos he could do instead. That is true. Not to mention the tag. Oh, oh, okay. It wasn't okay, enough with that F smash, keeping him off, keeping that recovery game going. Tries to pull a sneaky with the PK Thunder. Oh, another sneaky. Why did you land on Missing stage, Shadow Hawk? Why are you like this? Anyway. Mm hmm. So, so last game the sleek one was tired, but this game is clear that the sleek one is still tired, but instead he is tired of Shadowhawk's shit. <laughs> Tell him what's what. Oh, he's only got mm -hmm. about a stock lead. So AOC is supposed to be on for the entire tournament, but the sleek one only turns it on when he picks Fox. Oh. People keep forgetting to turn it on. Uh-huh. Which uh, the the incoming Womp build is going to solve, because it will just have it on by default. Oh, hell yeah. Tell me about the Womp the wom build. What should I expect from the Womp build? Well, ALC will be on. Um, there will be other things in store, but you got to keep them on the down low. Of course, of course. But there you have it, guys. Uh, one build, the new one, will have ALC on by default. And if somebody wants to be a sweaty loser and turn it off, they can. They just have to go yeah, over the rules and turn it off. It but the rule, of a the rule that won't have one today is that ALC is king. Yes. Online or offline doesn't matter because L canceling is stupid and bad. Yep. I am Wombat, and I approve this message. Yeah, so, um... We got a, a very different game, too, from game one. Um, I think it's really important for Shadowhawk to, like, win some series neutral game if he wants to sort of uh, close the ever-increasing gap. I have to sell for Bear. doesn't have enough time to roar Bear. Okay, we got another stepping on beach to root to do. And we are on our last stock of game two of Losers Quarterfinals of Wombat Wednesday 25. Um, this is still doable for Mr. Shadowhawk, but he cannot make a single mistake. Like when um, he missed ledge after that PK Thunder. Yeah, now we're at the point where he cannot get away with anything. One up mm -hmm. smash will kill him. One grab will kill him. Uh huh. One bear, almost kill him. Yeah, see, he's gonna start lasering more because he knows the like those straight back airs will start to kill if he get. Yep, there it is. Doesn't need a straight bear. He can get a straight up smash. And uh, the real good like check made about that situation where he started using those lasers against hypercent Lucas is that Lucas can't absorb them. Like, yes, in theory, he can absorb them, but yeah, well, since Fox has no lag after he lands from his lasers, he can bait out the absorb, which takes some time, and then just, like, run in and, like, a smash or something. We are going to game three, Green Hill Zone. The Fleek one is a very defensive uh, player. Um, needs enough room for dash dance trickery as well as laser camping. So I think this is a very good idea for Shadowhawk to go here. Um, I don't think Shadowhawk really cares about uh, when attacks kill from the, the top because his up smash is just so dummy strong that it will not matter in many circumstances. That's a great edge cancel on that side B from Sleep 1. Oh, yeah. It's kind of hard to keep up with because it's a moving platform. Yeah, which makes it all the more impressive. All right, we got some air stalling by Shadowhawk here. Okay, we got to up throw up air. Is that enough? No, it's not. Another blessing mm. of Green Hill Zone for this matchup is that um, the ceiling is much higher than most other stages, uh, mostly because the uh, the stage itself is so low to the ground. It's like so low in like in comparison to the rest of the stage that's available to them. 
That it is. But you need to remember that those bears, those nice bears, they're going to get a whole lot nicer down here. They sure are. Another boon of this matchup for Lucas. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because that shit spikes. And once you get bared, even if, it, at a, if it, you're at mid percent, you will not be able to survive on Green Hill Zone. Okay, okay, so we got, got some footsies here. Um, Shadowhawk tries to be cheeky. Sleek one catches him with an air. Okay, this time didn't mess up. Was able to grab ledge PK Thunder. But unfortunately, falls right, right into the right there. Yeah. Mm hmm. Alright, let's see. We got a little combo cooking here. Yep. Ooh. Oh my god, see, that's what I'm talking about. Shadow the off. nice bear. You're crazy. Alright, we got another punish. Uh huh. Only 26%, but that's like a falcon punch. That's like a falcon punch's worth of punish. Did the sleek one even get any iframes off the recovery platform? No, he got the frames, he just didn't use them. Oh, yeah, yeah, I know. It was as if he didn't have the iframes. All right, nice cash in with the up air. Oh, oh he right. accidentally so, side beat with an upbeat. Yeah, when that happens, it's usually because the player is playing their controller at something of a diagonal tilt. So, you know, they think they're going right, but they're actually going slightly up. Or in the sleep zone, in this case, the oh, 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 they both SD. So, Nice homie stock by Shadowhawk there. <laughs> that doesn't matter. He's he's not phased he's by the punish. Day. Okay, the bear and the back. Oh, he misses the back air. Oh my he, god! That's gonna spike him. He he does it again. It was Jesus it Christ! It's wild. I didn't I didn't even know that could happen. That Where was, are we gonna go this that was time? Something. Uh, that was something. Shadowhawk just needs one more game to defeat Sleek One and move on to loser semifinals. Three, two, All right, we got Final Destination as a counter pick from Fox. Classic, no f items. Fox only Final Destination. Shadowhawk's mm -hmm. breaking the rules. He's playing Lucas, but you know they're both space animals. Uh-huh, uh-huh. So Final Destination has no platforms. Um, this is probably it's better true. for both characters because they're very combo intensive. Uh, when Fox up throws, he can just convert more easily into that up air he, that he just got because Shadowhawk has no platforms to tech off of. Crazy! <gasps> Shadowhawk, he was chill! Don't chill. actually chill, but chill! He's just a boy! He's just a little furry fox boy with, with two real organic feet. Yes, I'm a gamer boy. Yes, I have feet. We Yes, we exist. All right, Sword Bates. Uh, Sleek One makes a nice tech roll, oh, opposite direction of Shadowhawk's wave dash. He's getting a lot of mileage out of these dash attacks on FD when... Uh... Fox doesn't have the opportunity to move around on platforms. Yeah, that was a really nice uh, uh, call out with uh, the down smash. Very uh, nicely timed too, to give the sleek one's recovery. Ooh, nice oh, call out wow. on which way he was going to, uh, which way he was going to uh, get up after the missed tech. Yeah, that was a real panic too. That uh, that roll away. That roll away was such a panic move right there. Mm -hmm. And the sleek one, he was counting on it. I guess that's why they that's why they call it a panic. But yeah, see, he starts lasering when he's at the flight deficit because he knows that uh, Lucas can't afford to uh, absorb it. <gasps> oh my god! Was that a raw bear? That was a 
No, that was uh, he turned himself around with the um, magnet. That was sh nice. Huh? Oh no. Yeah, sort of he's, his, yeah, uh, he's losing the stock. That, he did lose for stock it. for that. All right, well, now Shadowhawk is pretty much back on his bullshit. So, like, that up smash didn't scare huh. me. Okay, we got a punch for Shadowhawk here. He's cooking. Amazing he's cooking. Punch. Is this a clippy? There's so many Shadowhawk clippies he's in cooking. this game alone. Oh! Someone clipped that. That oh, was incredible.